An estimated four and a half million people rely on the Kariba Dam for their water and electricity. Built in the 1950s, the dam provides more than 50% of Zambia and Zimbabwe's power. But the infrastructure of the world's largest man-made dam is in desperate need of refurbishment. A rehabilitation program will begin next year with the remodeling of the plunge pool. Refurbishment of the six outlet gates will be done one at a time, each taking a year to complete. This is a very important project to assist in improving the safety and reliability of the dam and needed some very urgent action to avoid a potential emergency situation that would have re resulted in a devastating situation in the entire Zambezi River Basin and uh, loss of human lives, and more specifically to these two countries uh, in terms of a reliable power supply. Funding for the project will be provided by different partners. Cost of the dam is estimated at 295, and this uh, contribution from the European Union the World Bank, the African Development Bank, and also Sweden will make the work actually start almost immediately. Concerns have been raised about the stability of the dam wall in the past. The Zambezi River Authority says gradual maintenance has been performed to avoid the degradation of key safety features. This rehabilitation program will ensure the dam continues to provide water and electricity for years to come. Valdi Carosa. CCTV.